My real name is Rochelle, and I am Alice in Dairyland, which is why people call me Alice a lot of times, but that's not my real name. And I get to travel around the entire state of Wisconsin to talk about agriculture for one year. It's my job to do that. And today we're going to talk about the food side of agriculture and growing a healthy Wisconsin. But I want you to also think about other ways that we use agriculture, because agriculture gives us materials to make clothing. Right? Cotton grows in a field. Agriculture also gives us materials to build shelter. Keep us warm, keep us dry, it's raining out today. And I use agriculture driving here today because my fuel is made out of corn, ethanol, which is grown here in Wisconsin. That's part of agriculture. Are we ready to play? Yeah! yeah. All right, this is Wisconsin's official state beverage and fourth graders, you need at least three glasses every single day to get enough calcium for all 206 of your body's bones. Hmm. Living in Wisconsin, I wonder what this beverage could be. Milk. Milk. Wisconsin has more than 11,400 dairy farms producing this beverage for us. Milk. All right, we've got milk down. Let's see what this one is. Each of these berries has more than 200 seeds on the outside, and eight of them have more vitamin C than one orange. Back there in the corner. Strawberries. Strawberries. Yes. Wisconsin farms grow over 1,000 acres of strawberries, which is enough to fill more than 8 million jars with strawberry jam. Everybody give me a big thumbs up. So. Like this gentleman. Yeah. All right, I got two back there. One piece about the size of an adult's thumb, so a bit bigger than yours is at this age, gives our bones the same amount of calcium as one carton of milk. And Wisconsin has been a leader in the production of cheese since 1910, way before you were all born, before I was born. So our clues tell us that it's a cheese, but we also know that there are more than 600 to choose from. Which cheese do you think it is? Which cheese do you think it is? Cheese. Cheddar cheese. You're right. Wisconsin makes more cheddar cheese than any other state. And we might like mild, medium, or sharp. All right, this is possibly the only vegetable that all fourth graders would like to eat every day. They contain carbohydrates for energy, potassium to help our muscles move. And the skin of this vegetable has lots of nutrients. Mm. Not peas. Back there in the blue shirt. Okay. Not carrots. Very closely at this one. Straw. What, me? No, right here. Mashed potatoes. We grow mashed potatoes? Oh, no. We grow potatoes to mash. Yeah, Wisconsin ranks third in the nation for growing spuds, potatoes. Speaking of protein, one small piece of this gives our bodies zip. That stands for zinc. Iron and protein. One large animal produces enough of this meat to make 720 quarter pound burgers. Which one do you think it is? Uh, cow. All right, we remember those vocabulary terms that we learned? A cow is a girl. A bull. A boy is a bull. But we don't just eat one or the other. What do we call this group or this type of meat? You're stretching. Beef. Beef. Okay. So we have dairy animals, dairy cows, dairy bulls, and dairy cows, as well as beef. <laughs> this was Wisconsin's first major crop, and most of it is used for feeding our farm animals, kind of like our oats. But we use it to make bread and pasta and cereal. We. This one is beef. In just nine seconds, this combine can harvest enough wheat to make 90 loaves of bread. The last thing that I brought to you is cheese.
not only because they gave us cheese, which is awesome, but because they give us all of the things that we talked about, plus clothing and shelter and fuel every single day. Have fun. Yeah.